In this video, we will show you how to go back into remote mode while being in local mode on ATB312 drives versions 5.1 i.e. 5.6 and higher. The reason why this number exists is because on versions below 5.6 you actually could have used the mode key to go back and forth between local mode and remote mode. But since we have a drive that's rated for higher than that, for version higher than that, the only way to go back into remote mode while you are stuck in local mode is to do a factor reset. So we're going to be showing you that. The first thing you have to do here is you have to go into the programming mode to change the parameters in the first place. So to do that from here, you have to press the escape key and hold it for about three seconds. And you'll notice your lights are going to flash at the same time on the top left of your keypad there. Now, you want to go ahead and press enter on the dial and scroll down into the I.O. menu, enter. Now you want to scroll down into FCS, Frank, Charlie, Sam. Once you see this, this is your factor reset parameter. You want to press enter on the parameter. And of course, to do a factor reset, you have to go ahead and set this value to I and I by scrolling clockwise. Once you see this, to take this into effect, you'll have to press and hold the enter for about two or three seconds, and you will notice your display is going to go back to no automatically. So at this point, you've done a factory reset. So if you escape back out to your main screen, you have no more lights flashing on the top left anymore and your drive is now going to accept commands from the AI1 and your terminals as a means of speeding up and running and stopping because that's your factory reset mode for these drives and now we can go back through your control menu and program the drive that fits best for your application. 